Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the network printer error code 0x0000011B. Windows cannot connect to the printer. Error operation failed with error code 0x0000011B. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu, type in regedit, best match should come back a registry editor, go ahead and right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, select yes. And before you proceed, I would suggest you create a backup of your registry. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back. So in order to create a backup, all you have to do is select file and then export. File name, I recommend naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Set export range to all and save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer. And if you ever need to import it back in, like if you made a mistake, you could just select file and then import and then navigate to the file location. So pretty straightforward process. And now we're ready to begin. So we're going to start off by double clicking on the HK local machine folder. Do the same thing now for the system folder. Same thing for current control set, double click on that. Should be a control folder in here, double click on it. And now you want to locate print, so go down to print here. And if you need to take note of our file path, you can see it up at the top of the screen here. Each backslash is a different subfolder we've gone under to get to this point. So while selecting the print key on the right side, you want to right click in a blank area, select new, and then select the word 32 bit value. Name this key RPC. Auth, A-U-T-H-N, level, L-E-V-E-L, privacy, P-R-I-V-A-C-Y, enabled, E-N-A-B-L-E-D. So again, R-P-C, A-U-T-H-N, L-E-V-E-L, P-R-I-V-A-C-Y, E-N-A-B-L-E-D. So R-P-C, auth, level privacy enabled exactly you see it on my screen click out of it to save it and now you want to go ahead and double click on this value make sure it's set to zero so for example this value for some reason was already in here you would just double click on it and you would set the value that at the zero exactly how you see it on my screen and then you'll select OK and now at this point you will need to close out of the registry editor and fully reset your system for the changes to take effect And there you go, guys. So hopefully I was able to resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching. Do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.